I'm standing with senior catcher Brooke Ware, who just broke the school record for career home runs. Congratulations, Brooke. Thank you. How does it feel to finally get the monkey off your back? You hit that home run after a 13-game drought. What's going through your head? It's definitely a huge relief. I kind of felt like I was in a bit, a little bit of a slump, just pressing too much at the plate, a little anxious, jumping on pitches that weren't necessarily on my pitch. But I talked with my coaches, just had to sit back, see my pitch, and just drive at the opposite field. And that's where I'm best at hitting balls, opposite field. You got a hold of it. You see it has a chance. What's going through your head as you're rounding first base? You finally break the record. What What's going through your head? I'm just like, oh, I hope this doesn't hit the top of the fence. But when I saw it go over, I mean, I was ecstatic. I jumped around first base and just a huge relief off my back for the for going into the postseason. So you take down to sales. You sweep the doubleheader. You're going into the postseason now on the road at Susquehanna. A lot of things need to happen. What do you think that you and the squad need to build off of moving into the weekend? We definitely need to work on our offense. That's been kind of a off and on uh, kind of slot for us the whole season. Um, but again, just keeping each other up um, and just staying positive. I mean, going to Susquehanna is definitely something that I haven't experienced. Um, conferences, we've always been at home. But um, just keeping each other up and just going there and knowing what we have to do each and every game. A lot of positive vibes moving forward. Congratulations again on breaking the school record, career home run record, home run number 36. Congratulations, Brooklyn. Thank you. Standing alongside head coach John Byrne, who just swept to Sales University in their final home regular season games of the season. Coach, what really clicked today? Obviously, a lot of uh, a milestone with Brooke Ware breaking the home run record. Things clicked for you today. Yeah, real happy for Brooke. Uh, uh, set that record uh, well deserved and uh, well earned. Uh, couldn't happen to a better person and uh, came at a big big moment sort of broke that second game uh, open for us but uh, once we started hitting the ball hard good things happened and uh, you know hopefully uh, that uh, carries into the second season uh, playoff season coming up but it was a great way to uh, end the regular season so like you said you end the regular season this afternoon you're heading into playoffs at Susquehanna on the road you open with the University of Scranton what do you want to continue to build off of from today's game this past weekend into this new season? Yeah, I think we have to build on the fact that uh, we've beaten everybody in the conference, so nobody at the tournament uh, is is uh, out of out of our league in the sense that uh, we've had success. Uh, all good teams, all well deserved to be there, and uh, we respect their their uh, records. But uh, right now, everybody has a zero zero record when you go to the second season, which uh, you know we just talked a little bit about uh, with the team. So uh, we're just going to try to build on a very successful uh, regular season and hopefully carry some of the momentum uh, that we had today uh, toward the end of the week. So it was good to get a game in during the week uh, of playoffs, uh, uh, see some live pitching and be in that competitive atmosphere. So hopefully that will help us as we go into the uh, postseason here, and uh, we're looking forward to it. Greyhounds finished the regular season at home with a series sweep over to Sales University. Head coach John Byrne with me. Thank you for, so much for your time. Thanks, LJ.